Hello students, in this question we have to use the properties of determinants and prove that determinant of 1, 1, 1, A, B, C, A cube, B cube, C cube is equal to A minus B into B minus C into C minus A into A plus B plus C. First of all, let us say that this determinant is delta 1, 1, 1, A, B, C, A cube, B cube and C cube. Now this looks a very, very simple determinant. But if you see the expression on the right hand side, that is very much complex. That's the multiplication of four terms. We see that we have to open the bracket, the determinant first of all. So as many zeros as we are able to create, it will be good for us. Let's say we do C1 goes in C1 minus C3. This will give you 0, 1, 1, B. C, B cube, C cube as it is and over here you will get A minus C and A cube minus C cube. The same thing we can do in column 2 as well. So let's say that column 2 goes in column 2 minus column 3. Therefore we will get 0, oh, sorry, 0, A minus C, A cube minus C cube as it is. Here we will get 0, B minus C, B cube minus C cube and the third column as it is which will be 1, C and C cube. Now we see in the first column A minus C is there in the second row and in the third row it is A cube minus C cube which is also A minus C into A square plus C square plus A C. But if we look in the form that we wanted, we wanted C minus A. So we will take out only C minus A common. So this will be C minus A from column number 1. This gives us 0, 1, B minus C, B cube minus C cube as it is and C and C cube as it is. Over here it will still be 0, here it will be minus 1. Here it will be the leftover part after the expansion. So a square plus ac plus c square. Now we can also take out the same thing common from the second column. Let's take out b minus c as we wanted it in the form. So c minus a into b minus c taking out from column number 2. So column number 1 remains as it is minus of a square plus ac plus c square. Column number 2 0. 1 and b square plus c square plus bc the leftover after expansion of bq minus cq and the third column also as it is. Now we already have got two terms out of the four terms. The next term that we wanted was a minus b. So for that we can say that let c1 go to c1 plus cq Therefore, we have C minus A and B minus C as it is 0, 0, 1, C, C cube, 1, B square plus BC plus C square as it is and C1 goes to C1 plus C2. So, here also we get 0 and here we get B square minus A square plus BC minus AC. So on simplifying this term b square minus a square and bc minus ac, we take out the common part which is c from these two terms that will give us c times b minus a and this will also give us b plus a, b minus a. So we can take out 0, 0, 1, c, c cube as it is, 1, b square plus bc plus c square also as it is. Here is 0, b minus a common. We get over here b minus a, b plus a will come out from the first bracket and from the next two terms c would come out. So we get c minus a into b minus c into a minus b also common now. We are left with 0, 0, 1, c, 
सीखिए एंड जीरो वन बी स्क्वायर प्लस बी सी प्लस सी स्क्वायर एंड हियर माइनस ऑफ ए प्लस बी प्लस सी Now, from the first column, if we see, we can take out a plus b plus c. So c minus a into b minus c into a minus b. This will give us an a plus b plus c coming out as common from column number one. We will get zero zero minus one zero one b square plus b c plus c square one c c q. So if we expand along C one because we have maximum number of zeros over here, we get C minus A into B minus C into A minus B into A plus B plus C as it is, and on expansion we get minus one times zero minus one. So this that would again give you one totally. This answer would be C minus A into B minus C into A minus B into A plus B plus C. This is equal to the RHS. So hence, this will be the solution to our problem.